In this simple circuit our task is to find power which is uh, supplied or absorbed by this voltage source. And we will apply uh, different techniques on, di on diagram analysis at first, and nodal analysis, and then a superposition theorem. So at first on diagram analysis, but for all these three approaches, the first step actually is a replacement of this uh, passive two port, which is uh, built of 8, 8, 0 0.8, 0 0.8, 4 and 6 ohm resistors, we may uh, easily replace uh, these four resistors by a single one. We may find an equivalent resistance. It is shown on this slide how to do this. These two resistances in parallel will give 2.4 and then in series with these two will give 4 ohm a resistor, equivalent resistance. Then having this resistance and uh, knowing a voltage across this resistance which is designated by our source, voltage source, we may calculate this current and from Kitchell's current law for this node we may calculate current that flows through a voltage source and this current is 1 ohm. Then power of this source is 4 for what? And uh, this source satisfies a uh, passive sign convention. Uh, power is positive. Then for what is uh, power absorbed? Power supplied then is minus for what? Now a nodal analysis. Uh, once again the first part is the same as before. We replace uh, these four resistors by a single one. Then we may formulate a single equation, nodal equation, for this circuit. This equation is presented here. Uh, v multiplied by 1 over 4 and at the right side we have uh, some algebraic sum of uh, source currents uh, 2 amp um, and for this branch we will uh, represent this branch by its current minus i. Uh, we know a voltage V which is 4 then easily we may find from this equation current is 1 amp and power is 4 watt which is power absorbed. Now superposition theorem we have a circuit built of two sources current and voltage source built in uh, connected in parallel and then in parallel with 4 ohm resistor. The power is not a, a superposable quantity however we may calculate currents and voltages by means of superposition we, can, we may calculate this current using a superposition and then we may calculate overall power of this voltage source which is a product of this current and source value. Then from this source we obtain uh, this circuit we obtain two circuits one with a current source one with a voltage source trivial circuits uh, calculation of, of components of current that flows through a voltage source is trivial 2 amp and minus 1 amp. Uh, we may add algebraically these two uh, components to obtain 1 amp uh, total current that flows uh, through a current source passive sign convention for what which means that this power is absorbed. And we may verify uh, this solution by means of PSPICE, uh, the original circuit uh, for nodes uh, designated here and at least at the right side and below part of the output file and obviously the power absorbed for what?